I'm Star TV. It's your host, Blitz, with my motherfucking dog, Eve White, in the building. Jim Star. Jim Star. Hold up. Let me see if they can get it. Oh, yeah, Jim Star Records. You see that? You know, that's the shirts out. You know, go cop those. But, anyways, our topic for today is. Let me get high first. Mm. Up, up. How, you, how you feeling today, eh? I'm alright. I'm a motherfucker, you know. Trying to work on a little, uh, get a little higher, you know. Yeah, you do this. <laughs> I need it for the pain, motherfucker. You see this shit? <laughs> shit hurt. So, today's topic is <coughs> Everybody wants to be a rapper <coughs> How you feel? Everybody wants to be a rapper right? Everybody wants to be a rapper You know, if you want to be a rapper, get up and do something about it But, you know, what are you going to rap about though? You going to rap about what you about, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't be fake about it, you know. You're not gonna lie about it. Don't lie about it. Yeah, exactly. Tell the truth in your rhymes and shit. Exactly. Yeah. Don't be a hypocrite either. Not a hypocrite. I mean, I mean, I always felt like, I always felt like, if you got something to say and it's worth saying it, then that's when you go into the studio. But if you go into the studio and you ain't got nothing to say, like you know what I'm saying? What the fuck is the you even going in and talk about? <laughs> Especially if it's not real. Especially if it's not real. Like, if you just go go over there and talk about, you know, busting guns and, and selling crack and doing this and doing that, regardless if you did it or not, because you know there's probably about a good 85% of them niggas that never, never fucking touched a 58, 58 or a 12, 12 skinny in their life. Niggas don't know how to how to measure a scale with a nickel, like, you know what I mean? But I'm just saying. Yeah, I hear that. That's a, that's why that's why I called the you know that's why I called the the mixtape substance abuse. Yeah. Don't be what you ain't. You know what I'm saying? Don't put yourself out there to be something that you ain't. Talk about some real shit. I just want to say something right now. I bring a feel back. You see that? Bring the feel back, bitches. Bitches, bitches. Niggas wear some feel. Oh, some feel on, nigga. <laughs> feel it. Throw that shit on. Throw some feel on. Nah, I gotta bring the feel back. Cool. It's the only thing that wouldn't fit around this motherfucker I could wear comfortably. But anyway, everybody wants to be a rapper. So, why? That's the question. That's what I want to know. Why does everybody want to be a rapper? Why do you want to rap? You think it's gone? <clears throat> it's gonna get you up out of the hood. It's gonna get you money. Chicks are gonna it's like you. Bitches, money. You know, people think they're gonna. You know, don't be a rapper for what 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 you want to become of yourself. Be a rapper for who you are. You know what I'm saying? I can so dig that. You're gonna, so way you're gonna respect it anyway. You know? So that, way you're so gonna get respect. I can definitely dig that. Well, I say it because it's been my dream since I was a kid. Just like any real MC who's out there knows. <clears throat> this shit's been their dream since they was kids. Listening to motherfucking Hot 97 before 93.7 was even out, my nigga. You know? The, the, you know what I mean? When, when, when most of them kids, these kids was on rock and roll and Guns and Roses and shit. I was getting uh, motherfucking A-plus tape. A-plus last key child. Go check that tape out. That's my first hip-hop tape. A-plus the last key child. Shout out to my cousin Frank, he gave me that motherfucking tape. That was the shit. And then we started stealing the CDs just to listen to him. And he got on that shit. But anyway, shout out to Guns N' Roses too, though, because I do like rapping to the jungle, nigga. I am a rocker, nigga. I rock out. Ah. No, I'm fine. But, um, yeah. So, it was my dream. It's not these niggas' dreams to rap. <laughs> <clears throat> it's your dream to get some money because you motherfuckers is probably broke as shit, but It was my motherfucking dream to rap, babe Feel me? Uh, yeah. It was my dream to make music in its entirety, feel me? 
I write rap, I write a hip hop song, I write a R&B song, nigga, I write anything. Motherfucker raps R&B, man, you know? I can write R&B, there you go, I write R&B, yeah. I don't really sing too much, but I write r and But, uh, yeah, man, the way y'all motherfuckers rapping out there, it doesn't seem like it's in your heart. So I tell you, here's my words of wisdom. Before you write down your song, after you write down your song, while you writing it actually, if you're not anxious to go into the studio and record it, then it's not worth mentioning. And I've said that before and I'll say it again. And this is my motherfucking man E. White. I'm Blitz. This is Gemstar TV. <laughs> and that's it. Peace out. Peace. We'll see you tomorrow. It's some more bullshit. Oh, no. <laughs> Behind is what we do. Yeah, yeah. That's what we do, nigga. Gemstar, nigga. Get with the fucking movement. Don't get it fucked up. Holla. <laughs>